Dear friends, my name is Dr. Gaurav Agdwal. I am a pediatric cardiologist working in Delhi. Today I will discuss in brief about the preterm PDA. First of all, what is the meaning of preterm and what is the meaning of PDA? Preterm means when the baby is delivered between 24 weeks to 37 weeks of gestation. This is known as preterm babies. And what is the meaning of PDA? There are two great vessels arising from the heart, one each from lower chambers. There is a connection between these two great vessels when the child is in fetal stage. This is known as ductus arteriosus or PDA, patent ductus arteriosus. Normally, it closes within 48 hours in majority of the newborn babies who delivered after 37 weeks of gestation. But in case of preterm PDA, it will depend how early the delivery occurred, how lower is the weight of the baby and how much, how big is the size of the PDA. If the child is delivered early in early gestation, for example, 26 weeks of gestation, then the recovery will be delayed as compared to those who are delivered around 34 weeks of gestation. PDAs are more common in female babies as compared to male babies, more common in babies who are delivered at high altitude like Nepal or Uttarakhand and whose mother is infected with the rubella, known as congenital rubella syndrome. What can be the signs and symptoms due to preterm PDA? If it is significant in size, the most common signs and symptoms can be cough and cold, difficulty in feeding, difficulty in breathing, uh, uh, sweating over forehead while feeding, dependency on ventilatory support like CPAP or ventilator, and poor urine output in shock-like state, necrotizing, enterocolitis, etc. can be the manifestation of preterm PDA. How can we diagnose this preterm PDA? The most important tool to diagnose this PDA is by doing pediatric echocardiography in which we use the ultrasound probe on the chest known as the echocardiography. We can diagnose each and every case of preterm PDA by doing echocardiography or 2D echocardiography. After diagnosing, what is the treatment of preterm PDA? It will depend on how early is the delivery occurred, how much is the size of the PDA, what are the symptoms of PDA and how much is the weight of the child. Suppose if the child is dependent on ventilatory support, then we have to treat. For treating preterm PDA, there are three methods. One is conservative by decreasing uh, fluid intake, by uh, setting the ventilatory parameters. And uh, if all these measures are failed, then another option is medical treatment of PDA by using some IV paracetamol or crocenta uh, injection or by oral brufen syrup, we can treat this PDA medically also in case of preterm babies. If all these measures are failed, then we have to treat the PDA either by surgery from the back as shown in this picture or by doing angiographic technique from using the thigh vessels, we enter into the heart and we can place the device as shown in this picture across this PDA. But the angiographic method is not possible in every case of preterm PDA. Uh, it all will depend on the weight of the baby along with size of the PDA. If the size of the PDA is less than 3.5 mm, we can close angiographically. If it is more than 3.5 to 4 mm, then only surgical option by doing surgical ligation is there. After closing this PDA, the baby can be discharged early, weight gain will be very good and symptoms will be very less. For more detail, you can log in to my website childrenheartcare.com. Thank you very much.